President Rodrigo Duterte gives Senator Laila de Lima his unsolicited advice. Meanwhile, President Duterte lets the Philippine National Police decide on the resumption of its anti-illegal drug operations as long as policemen to be designated in the operations are not corrupt. Rosalie Cos will tell us why. Well, uh, we can only pray that the truth will come out eventually if there is another truth. This is the first public statement of President Rodrigo Duterte about Senator Leila de Lima since she was ordered arrested by the Muntinlupa Regional Trial Court last Friday. President Duterte is also sure the lady senator is safe inside Camp Crame. Oh, oh, I'm sure that she is safe. I, I am. Well, and, uh, I think uh, people are interested not to see her death, but to see her in prison for what she did. He will let the court decide on the case against the senator and will leave it up to the people to tell who is saying the truth or lying. President Duterte admits that critics of his administration should really be afraid, especially if they are really involved in drugs. However, when asked if Senator Antonio Trillanes will be the next target of his administration, this was his response. It's too insignificant to bother you, sir. Meanwhile, President Duterte lets the Philippine National Police decide on the resumption of its anti-illegal drug operations. The, ganito, the, the, the La Rosa's job is to look for young men in the PNP who are imbued with patriotic fervor to serve their country. Yon ang kunin niya tapos i-martial niya against the... Because there is again a rise of the uh, uh, drug activities uh, by 20%. So hindi talaga mat sinabi ko sa it's a virulent thing. Hindi matapos-tapos yan. Well, I said, uh, look, give me for the men that I can trust to handle the campaign. Rosa Licoz, UNTV News and Rescue, Malacanang.